Welcome back to the Football Referee with Emmy Hickins, Trevor Gear, and Femi Madariola. Really looked into, you know, his background football wise, you know. Um, so I'm a bit, I'm a bit on the fence, just just like yeah. you, yeah. Um, as to whether he'll deliver or not. You know, we just have to see how his first game goes, you know. Yeah. Um, and the selection, I think, um, I think he's got a good squad actually, because I I read something about Phil Ford and um, uh, what's the other guy's name? Uh, so Phil Ford and uh, Ollie Watkins, um, Cole Palmer. Um, so that's that's the that that's the ones that I know so far. Um, yeah. I don't. Yeah, I don't know about any other ones at the moment. Um, so, Manchester United, Trevor. Do you think Ten Hag will? Do you think they, uh, there's discussions about? <laughs> I, I, I said it. Yeah. <laughs> it's very hard. It's very hard to know, isn't it? Because I, I was quite pleased. I, I quite like the bloke. I think he should be given more time. Um, I think. The, the Man United owners gave him a confidence boost after the defeat against Liverpool the other day. But then that can sometimes, you know, a, a positive, confident word of backing from the board can sometimes be the kiss of death. You find a week or two later, yeah. they sack them. But yeah. I, I get the feeling that he's going to be given most of this season or all of this season, provided they don't go on a bad run of... Defeats. I mean, if they were to lose, you know, three or four in succession, then he'll be finished, un undoubtedly, probably like many other Premier League managers. But, yeah, it's a difficult one. Man United are not, they're not the Man United that we've known for quite a long time. I know they, they've had a few down times, but, you know, last season, they, they still finished fairly high, didn't they? They, yeah. they finished up there, was it sixth or fifth, something like that? Uh, which I suppose we still felt for them wasn't a successful season. But they've not started overly well this time. And I don't know, you know, I've got nothing against um, Maguire at the back. I think I think he's passed his best days, I have to say. And in a way, I'm surprised he was, he's was he been sort of brought back as a first-team choice. Um, but they don't seem to have a, a settled team. I mean, Casemiro is coming in for a lot of flack. Um, particularly in his game the other day, and some of the pundits are sort of roasting him, which may or may not be a bit unfair, it seems to me, but they're just not playing as a team like they can. Rashford is another one. I mean, I think two or three years ago, he was a, he was a very good player, but I think, again, lately, he doesn't seem to be the Rashford of old. I mean, he was not included in the Euros, finally, was he? He didn't play there. So I think it... We're going to take a short break now. The Football Ref will be back shortly. You're listening to The Football Referee with Emmy Hickens, Trevor Gear, and Femi Madariola. The Football Referee will be back shortly. Please stay tuned. The Football Referee is looking for sponsors. If you're a business out there looking to spread the word about the products and services you offer, please get in touch on our website, deepstuffrecords.com. And also, if you're looking to get involved on this show, please reach out via our Facebook page, Deep Stuff Radio or Deep Stuff Records. Thank you.